Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tenager, and I am playing some Mass Effect 3. We've just saved the Citadel again. Uh, that's right, that's Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. What? The Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. It's a low gravity planet, toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? You're gonna oh, die. You security, Sergeant OMB? No, Private. We are not. Are we playing security or probably playing security? Man, I oh, it's a Vina. Security at Sonics, what? And there was definitely Prothean tech on Garbug. I know the Valhalla threshold is Reaper territory now, but Prothean tech could help the cruise. More yes. things for me to go get. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I'm aware this is an unsecured channel. Yes, understood. And somebody just got owned. Oh, hi there, Miss Ashley, whose texture is not loaded in for a couple seconds. Hi, I honey. don't know what to say. I'm trying to go over everything in my head. Make sense of it. Your bandages were still fresh. How did you end up working with Udina? Because she got made a specter! You saw me in the hospital. I was going crazy. Felt like I was letting everyone down. When Udina offered to make me a specter, I thought it was a chance to do some good. I couldn't just sit back and watch either. <coughs> nope. Yeah. But it sure turned into a mess. You don't say! I never wanted to put you in that situation. We're on the same side. Well, that'll be the first and last time I wave a gun at my commanding officer. Yeah, you better not! I stopped Udina and got to walk away. That's the important part. I can't believe he was responsible for all of it. Was he indoctrinated? It's Maybe. How do we fight something that can worm its way into your head? I don't know. But we don't have a choice. I wanted to talk to you about that. What? Hackett asked me to join his team. It's a great offer, but... I'd prefer to ride this thing out aboard the Normandy. <laughs> no, screw you! No, welcome aboard, Ash! Permission granted, Lieutenant. Just keep your gun pointed at the Reapers, okay? Instead of I at prefer. me? Thanks. Yeah. Grab your gear and find a bunk, Williams. Aye, aye, Captain. We've only got and so Ash. many, and you can't yeah. use mine. It's good to have you back. Yes, ma'am. Even though you tried to shoot me. Well, you pointed the gun at me. You didn't actually do the shooting of the me. Because if you had, we would have had more words. This loading is gonna take a while. I tried to see if I could get off of the uh, Citadel without triggering a cutscene so that I could go do some extra side questy things off screen, and that's why I know that this loading screen is going to take us quite some time. Because that's exactly what it did. Oh, there it goes. There we go. I talked Shepard, through it, I got huh? Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Hi, Anderson. Odina. That SOB was always power hungry. But this? He was probably he in indoctrinated. Charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the Citadel. Yep. What the hell for? Reasons? I don't know. Not yet. Reasons? Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Counselor Valorn. Kyle. What? You know Your him! Assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. I take it you two have met. <laughs> Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. Your I share of run-ins? I both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But he should have begun on Omega, even stronger. Elusive man patch him up? Probably. That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson, it's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. I need to finish reading that book. It's sitting next to my bed right behind me. Ah! I have all of the Mass Effect books. The novels. I have all of them. <laughs> I'll take whatever advantage I can get against these bastards. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Oh, good! Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Hopefully. <laughs> yes, the Asari and Solarians are both throwing in their support now. They better be! progress on the Crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So quickly? Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean specific. Hmm. Okay, because that makes really sense. closer to understanding how to use it. That's still open for debate. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is, how will it dispense the energy? And in what form? You mean, how do you stop it from wiping us all out? 
Exactly. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. We'll figure answer, it Shepard. out. <laughs> I'll send you an update on the schematics. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. I won't fail. You've always trusted I'm me. The I won't let you down. We're still I am in this. The, the gods of war haven't given up on us yet. God Good of luck, war. Both of you. Anderson out. I never played Command that game. Command the Tyrian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships, and the Quarians are willing to talk. Are they now? Understood, sir. I'll look We're into gonna it. go see Tali. We're gonna go see Tali. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. We're gonna go see Tali. We're gonna go see Tali. Shepard. Hi, Lee. Do you have a moment? No. A contact yes. within Asari High Command was insistent I pass on a distress signal to you. Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. That's not good. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on this? <sighs> that they do wouldn't everything. ask for help if it wasn't important. The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. I'll try to figure out what's going on. Okay. Priority Perseus Veil. Vale. We're gonna go get Tali. We're gonna go get Tali. Okay, I, I, I want to see what I got. Let, let me, let me, please, please. Citadel Defense Force, yay! More Alliance. What do we got? Zeus Hope Colonist, yay! <laughs> Oh, Shiala. Good thing she's not no longer indoctrinated. Hmm. Easiest way to get rid of indoctrination. Get yourself mind probed by a giant plant. We got a bunch of Asari. Yay, the Asari. Ooh, we got even more Krogan. Yay, more Krogan. Just a little bit more Krogan. Just five more Krogan. Got a little bit more of them. Got a little bit more Tyrians. <laughs> there, we have to go see the distress signal on Masana. Cerberus coup. Goddamn Cerberus bastards. And Udina too. Son of a bitch. Yeah, he's not very nice. Udina made a deal with the devil. He got what he deserved. Come on, Hi, Trainer. I've got a lead on something interesting. Come What's on, wrong? I found something you need to see. Okay. What have you got? A group of Cerberus scientists cut ties and fled. Perhaps they finally realized they were on the wrong side. I know who's in that group. We don't know what group. they were researching, but they were among the elusive man's top scientists. They could help build the crucible. It's a good idea. Maybe we could recruit them. Lots of Cerberus people think they're doing the right thing. I know I did. And you were right, Commander. Whatever crimes Cerberus is committing now, I was on Horizon when the Collectors attacked. You were there? Really? I wonder if we could go find her. I mentioned growing up in the Terminus systems. I was visiting my family at home. While the Alliance was running studies, you were saving me and my family. I didn't notice. Has the Alliance tried to make contact with the scientists? They've been unable to find them, but they're searching. As is Cerberus. I've been monitoring Cerberus communications. You hacked into I their calls? I signal frequency from various Cerberus cells by location and cross-referenced known ship movements. You found them? I believe so, yes. Nice work. Put it on the map and I'll give it a look. Thanks for your time, Commander. No problem. But first is first. We gotta go get Tali. We gotta go get Tali. Oh, come on. You all know it's gonna be Tali. We gotta go get Tali. We gotta go get Tali. Tali, 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 Tali. Once we have Tali, my group is complete. We're gonna go meet Tali. We're gonna go meet Tali. Tali, I love your face. Tali, I love your face. Commander Shepard. A pleasure to see you. Oh, again. hi, Ron. Were under better circumstances. I like you, Ron. Hi, Ron. I hope for your support in the fight against the Reapers. What's going on? Seventeen days ago, with precision strikes on four Geth systems, the Quarians initiated the war to retake our homeworld. Worst timing ever! Which was a clear ever! violation of our agreement with the Council to avoid provoking the Geth. 
A treaty violation is nothing compared to recovering our homeworld and advanced AI technology. Your homeworld? You mean Renok? Correct. God Master. damn it! <laughs> 300 years ago, we lost our world to our own AI creations, the Geth. After we attempted to kill them. It Chorus is right there. Them, Chorus, we tried to deactivate them. It wasn't murder. Ah, eh, you guys are wrong. No, it was murder. No, it was murder. <laughs> I love the that. Just never intended to create a true AI. Dead it pan. Was an accident. Dead Which pan. Which you chose to correct by trying to kill them. <laughs> I never thought Chorus and I would agree with something. Admitting we were wrong would undercut the justification for this suicidal invasion plan. You're throwing yourselves at the Geth? Again? And this time, we may have destroyed our people for good. We'd driven the Geth back to their home system when this signal began broadcasting to all Geth ships. The Reapers. Under Reaper control, the Geth are significantly more effective. Uh-oh. Our fleet is pinned in the home system. If we're going to win, we're... Win? You insisted on involving the civilian ships, Admiral Geral. We need to retreat or we'll lose the life ships. Where's the signal coming from? Here. A Geth Dreadnought. It can outgun anything we've got and it's heavily defended. The Normandy can get the in? The Normandy stealth drive can get us in undetected. I could board, then disable the Reaper command signal. Yes. Cutting off the signal should throw the Geth into complete disarray. And while they're confused, you get to a mass relay and retreat. Good. Our civilian ships have seen too much fighting already. Are you certain you can disable the signal? We'll Probably. get you out of there safely, Admiral. Maybe. Our newest Admiral has also volunteered to offer technical expertise. Tolly, 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 Zora Vas Normandy, reporting for duty. <laughs> Glad you could make it, Tolly. Admirals, <laughs> already a team to hit that dreadnought. <laughs> Thank you, Commander. Hi, Tolly. I love your face. You are the best sister ever! Admiral? <laughs> it's mostly a formality. I'm an expert on the Geth. <laughs> there Admiral. you are. <laughs> tally, 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 tally. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. It's okay, honey. Love if I'd face. known it was this bad, I would have come sooner. You've had your own troubles. I'm sorry about Earth. We're getting it figured out. We've got the largest fleet in the galaxy. If you can help us, we'll hit the Reapers with everything we've got. Or however much is left from this stupid war. Ha! Ah, she doesn't agree either! The invasion. No. After talking to Legion, I thought maybe there was a chance for peace. So why help them? I'm an admiral. People look to me for guidance. Public disagreement would divide the fleet. Well, if you went for Chorus, then I'll it'd be, you, people you know, out half of and half. Safely, two, four, war, two Thanks, against. Shepard. And just so you know, you'd I need to keep late. things strictly business in front of the admirals. If you'd like to catch up, let's talk somewhere private. Sure thing. Call me up to my quarters, honey buns. I'm ready to hit that dreadnought whenever you are. We got a couple other things to do first, though. <laughs> Cause you are coming with me. Talking to the speaker in the bay. Okay. They also need to go talk to Tali. Tali, 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 Zora Vas Normandy. <laughs> I love that even as an admiral, she still keeps the name they gave her as an insult during her trial. She's like, you know what? No, you want to call me Vas Normandy? I'm Vas Normandy. Because the Normandy is amazing. <laughs> oh, we've got our team back, guys. We have got our team back. Tali, let's do some catching up, honey buns. Tali, I'm free if you'd like to come up. I'll just be a moment. Hi, honey. I need to make that outfit one of Thanks these days. Thanks for asking me up. I couldn't talk freely in front of Ron. No problem. You okay? No. No, I'm really not. Seventeen million lives are riding on me. And I don't know if I can save them. You're doing everything you can. If the fleet falls, it won't be because of you. I helped my father and... And Zen's ideas, the new tech that made an invasion too good to pass up, that's based on my father's work. Oops. If they die because of me, if... if I don't... 
We'll get them out of there safely, Tally. I couldn't do this without you, Shepard. I feel like I'm bluffing, trying to convince them that the Admiral's daughter knows what she's doing. Not the Admiral's daughter. The Admiral. Yeah! I know. And at least now, I can push back against the worst ideas. That's why I accepted the position. Like everything and that's going on right now? Me. When they offered me this position, I asked myself what you'd do. I thought you'd take the chance to make things better. That oh, probably honey. sounds stupid. It's just, I know I'm not really qualified for this. Sure you are. You're doing fine, Tally. And thanks. I should get back before the admirals get into trouble again. I'll talk to you later. You don't want to look at my new fish, Tally? You don't want to look at my new fish? Hey, look, I got fishies. I got fishies. Fishy, 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 fishy. Fishy, 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 fishy. Okay, I guess we gotta go talk to Jack, Wes. Then we can actually do something this episode. <laughs> I got Tolly back. Do 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 do. Garrus. Hi. Game load, please. Hi. How you doing, honey? Shepard. Hell of a day. Udina loses his mind. The Citadel almost falls. Again? And you almost had to put down a friend. But I didn't. Get a little tense there. If it had come down to it, could you have pulled the trigger? Ooh. You know what? If it came down to losing the entire council and losing the stability of the system... If they hadn't backed down, yes. This war is bigger than any one person. That's the truth. I said I'll I was going to answer that. every single thing truthfully. Oh, Still, I love your face. I have to join Caden. You. Losing one was enough. Yep. Yeah, we haven't lost anybody else yet. I love your face, guess. Good to have Ash back. We can always use a friendly gun. <laughs> Where is she anyway? Ash. Hi, Chakos. I see you standing there. Hi, honey. Commander, an opportunity has come to my attention that may interest you. Really? What's going on, Doctor? Refugees arrived at the Citadel recently in possession of military-grade medical supplies and equipment. Okay. In reviewing our inventories, I determined we have an excess of medical supplies to treat contagion, exposure, and malnutrition. They're equipped to help injured soldiers, and we have supplies to help suffering refugees. So let's trade! Precisely. Perhaps you let's could fly trade. your charms to broker a trade. Let's do it. I'll find the refugees as soon as I can. Speak with Tactus. Many of the refugees near the Citadel docks look to him for leadership. Thank you, Commander. With access to their equipment and materials, I believe I could increase the effectiveness of our Medigel. That's good. I would be okay with this. But it how you doing? All involved. If you could barter a trade of medical supplies, Fine. Fine. I'll do it. Garrus, have, have. Good to have Ash back. We can always use a friendly gun. We see Ashley. I don't know where she actually. Oh, there she is. Hi. Good to see you. Good okay. to see you. Good to see you. Let's see if I can get her neck to break. Good to see you. Yes. You can get her neck to turn at the weirdest Good angles. You. Oh my god! <laughs> Good to see you. This is much Good more entertaining you. than it should be. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. <laughs> what is Good wrong with you. your neck? <laughs> Good to see you. Good to see you. I'm pretty sure that's not how physics Good works. To see you. Okay, I'm done. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> That's not how physics works. Oh, that is so not how physics works. <laughs> that is not how physics works. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's not how physics works. 
Commander, Admiral Anderson is available in the war room on VidCon. God damn it, I just got here! Oh wait, I have to go this way. Unread messages at your private terminal, Commander. Thanks, trainer! <laughs> I want to go back to breaking Ashley's neck some more. Take that out of the context and it sounds really weird. Can I go now, please? Please? That took way too long. Hi, Dolly. At least you're not broken again. I have a picture that has her on my phone. I'm not even joking here. Instead of typing on the keyboard, she is turning around typing in the air. Okay. Anderson, what do you need? Shepard. I was hoping you'd check in again. You're the one who said you, you okay? want to talk to me. Been putting my old academy training to use. Organizing the resistance. You know, you've got quite a fan club back here. I do? Any news we hear <laughs> about the Normandy gives hope to the guys in the trenches. I know what that's like, fighting in the dark. I'm glad we're making a difference. It's more than that. A lot of these people have never held a gun in their life. Great. When they heard that you managed to get the Torians and Krogan to cooperate, that was a shot in the arm, Shepard. Of the one thing we're in short supply around here, faith that any of us will live to see another day. How bad is it? Pretty bad. It could be worse, but not much. <laughs> it could be worse. Can you worse. still coordinate any kind of counterattack? We're hitting the Reapers every chance we get. Mostly guerrilla-style hit and runs, but it's not enough. It's time we started focusing our efforts. Where? London. What? Something big is happening there. Our networks in the UK say the Reapers have arrived in huge numbers. Sounds bad. I don't like the sound of that. Any more details? No. And that scares the hell out of me. Well, yeah. the Crucible will scare yeah, the hell out of the Reapers. Damn straight. We're counting on it. Oh, and Shepard. I meant what I said earlier about Kai Lang. The Reapers may seem like our biggest threat, but take it from me. Lang is a vicious bastard. Don't underestimate him. Noted. Then I'll let you get back to it. Will do? We need whatever good news you can send our way. Anderson out. Bye, Anderson. Bye-bye. Okay, you, me, we need to have a talk. Hi, Ron. Shepard, the fleet is under heavy fire. We need to hit the Dreadnought. I'd like to know about your patrol fleet. In peacetime, the patrol fleet managed navigation, internal security, and intership conflicts or crimes. Now, we mostly guard the heavy fleet's flank. It's mostly light frigates or fighters. I like Ron. Tell She's me my about favorite the civilian admiral, fleet. except for Tolly. Our civilian ships, medical vessels, and live ships. Admiral Chorus coordinates them. Though individual ships' captains still have power. <sighs> In peacetime, they made up the bulk of our fleet. Now, our strength would even give the Turians pause. Really? Despite the fact you're only like 13, 17 million? That's actually pretty impressive. Tally said you had the largest fleet in the galaxy. The Turians have more dreadnoughts. Their overall military force is larger than our heavy fleet by far. But before we began this war, we jury rigged every Quarian ship in the flotilla for battle. Even our live ships have cannons. God damn! <laughs> You've converted them into dreadnoughts. That's a violation of the Treaty of Ferrixen. Why live ships have firepower comparable to a dreadnought? Their primary purpose is food cultivation. You think the Council will buy that technicality? Nope! <laughs> if you need me, I'll apologize once this war is over. And in the meantime, you're putting your civilians in danger. Not casually, Commander. We keep them off the front lines, but we'll do whatever we must to win. Um, what about the heavy fleet? What can you tell me about Admiral Garrel's heavy fleet? It was our main military force before the war, comprised of all Korean vessels suited for sustained combat. It can't compare to the Turian forces, of course, but we have a number of heavy frigates and advanced fighter forces. And apparently a whole bunch of civilian ships with cannons. Um, Admiral Zen. Which fleet does Admiral Zen command? Special projects. It's not a fleet per se. 
just a few research vessels. Research? Her technical breakthroughs have put us within striking distance of the home world. Yeah, the ones that she stole from Tolly's dead father. Bye. I'll let you get back to work. Thank you, Commander. No problem, bruh. And last, but certainly not least, Tolly! And that dreadnought is tearing through our fleet. Let me know when you're ready to hit it. Don't so worry about it. how did you end up back with your fleet, Tally? When the war started, the Admiralty Board asked for my help. I had more recent contact with the Geth than most of my people. They hadn't filled the spot on the board left by my father. I was invited in. Aha! Uh -huh. It's just a technicality. I'm far too young to be a real admiral. Yeah, it wasn't she a teenager in Mass Effect 1? yourself short, Tally. The board needed your expertise. You needed the authority that comes with rank. How did the war with the Geth get started anyway? Admiral Zen developed a scanning countermeasure that interferes with Geth active scans. It's like a flashbang grenade. It effectively crippled the Geth ships in combat. Damn! My fleet couldn't pass up the chance to attack. Could we use it to fight the Reapers? It only works against the Geth, unfortunately. Damn it! <laughs> Their AI lets them use extremely detailed LADAR pings. Zen's countermeasure overwhelmed them with garbage data. And it's useless now that the Reapers have upgraded their processing power. But it will be fine once we get rid of that! How is it being back with the fleet? Right now, it's exhausting. I'm an admiral in the middle of a war. I just want us to get out of this alive. Everything else can wait. When this is over, I could use your help. I can't, Shepard. If we survive this, we'll have a home world. My people need me. We still got a war! You could help your people's home world by fighting the Reapers. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not thinking that far ahead yet. We're gonna keep her with us, guys. Don't worry about it. So what about Legion? It returned to Geth space after you turned yourself into the Alliance. And you haven't seen it since? I... Uh, Legion and I sent a few messages. I was hoping we could try negotiation. And that didn't work, did it? But I was outvoted three to two. Admiral Chorus was the only one who believed it would work. Any idea where Legion is now? No. In our last message, it told me that the Geth were having trouble reaching consensus. And then nothing? Maybe it was fighting the Reaper takeover? Or maybe it didn't want to give intel to an enemy. I could have warned it about the invasion. I didn't. You'd have been betraying your own people. Oh, honey. But you also betrayed a friend in doing so. <sighs> Complicated! I never wanted to be an admiral. <laughs> Talk to you later, Tally. Bye, Tally. Sure. At least she's not glitched out and facing backwards anymore. Okay. We're gonna stop the video here while I figure out what I'm gonna do next. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Mass Effect 3. I'll see you all in the next episode.